we were looking at the cervical, brachial, acromial, scapular, and sacral regions. So for number three, I was indicating the highest point of the shoulder, which is the acromial region, not to be confused with the shoulder blade, which is the scapular region. One was referring to the antecubital region because that is the anterior portion of my elbow. Um, two, I had placed it right over the wrist bones, which is why it is carpal. Three is over the sternum, which is why it is the sternal region. Four is a little bit trickier, but it's on the lateral portion of the leg, right over where the hip joint would be which is why it is the coxal region. So one, um, even if I was indicating the back, your whole thigh is the femoral region, your kneecap is the patella, so over your kneecap is the patellar region. Three, uh, that is a butt muscle, so it's the gluteal region. Four, I'm indicating specifically the posterior part of the calf, which is the sorrel region. The whole lower leg would be crural, but if we're talking about the back, it's sorrel. And five, I've placed over the heel bone, which is the calcaneal region. All right, so one is the right hypochondriac region, two, either pubic or hypogastric would have been acceptable, three would have been the left lumbar, four, 
it's technically not a body region that I'm indicating. I was asking about a body cavity. Um, your chest cavity is the thoracic cavity, um, or your entire chest region is the thoracic region. So as mentioned previously, the most superior portion of the shoulder is the acromial region, the lateral appendage of the manus. The manus is the hand. The lateral appendage when you're standing in anatomical position, which is the only position we care about, is the thumb. The thumb is the pollux. The posterior portion of the knee is the popliteal region. Uh, lateral portion of the lower leg is the fibular region. Just your anterior hand is your palm, so your palmar region. And your head is the structure that sits superiorly to the cervical region because the cervical region is your neck. So your head is the cephalic region.